You know, Chris said Harvey, which was a Category 4, but strangely, I got this call from the Hurricane Center this week. They're wondering why somebody from the Weather Channel was telling them to reanalyze Harvey as a 5. I think Chris is still uh -huh. after him. Yeah, he was calling up. <laughs> well, it's time to actually see this week who's hot and who's hotter on quick, quick thinking hurricane knowledge. Time for Hurricane Hotline. Five questions that increase in intensity and points. Cat 1 is worth 1, up to Cat 4 that's worth 4. And... Cat 5 question is worth 10 points. So if you get sheared apart by your opponent in the first few rounds, you still have a chance to rapidly intensify. Now, Jackie, Jaris. Hello. Remember, as soon as I start asking the question, you have the option to pick up the phone. But at if you're any incorrect time? at any time, no question. and you got to speak it into the phone, I can't hear it otherwise. Okay? okay. So, <laughs> if you're wrong, he gets the points. Cat, oh. one question. Okay. Hurricane. That word. Has how many letters? Nine. Nine is correct for Mike Bennett. You saw my fingers. You saw my fingers. I was counting. One to nothing, Mike, but there's lots of points this yet to go. Category two question. A hurricane and a typhoon are the same type of weather system, just different parts of the world. The two terms also have different word origins. Which of the two words originates from a word meaning big wind or whirlwind? <laughs> Typhoon. Typhoon is correct. You're closer to that. Sometimes he plays the other way and lets the other person answer, but he's, right. he's feeling it tonight. Okay. You doing okay? Cat three question. In addition to the United States and its territories, Dorian directly affected several other countries as a... <laughs> the Bahamas. Are you done? Yes. <laughs> Because I was asking for two no. countries. Um, um, I'm thinking of another Caribbean island. It was, was it? Oh. Canada? Oh, I did have the Canadian Maritimes, but it wasn't, it was post-tropical by then, right? Um, okay, I'm going to go with the Bahamas and the Turks and Caicos. Incorrect. I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried. That, that's the risk of taking it early, but Mike gets the three points. Now, Jackie, here's the what good news. Gosh, it's I'm six so to nothing, lonely. Mike, but there are 14 what points. What was the answer? Canada, Barbados, St. Lucia. Barbados. Yeah. Oh, okay, here we go. Cat four question. In the past 25 Atlantic hurricane seasons, what was the only year that had zero major hurricanes? And it was also the last time we used this year's hurricane name list. Oh, um... <laughs> 2013? 2013 is correct. So good. Okay, now... I'm just not fast. Cat 5 is worth 10 points, Jackie. You get this right? Oh my you gosh, tie it so up and we go to Cat 6. What are the names of the three storms that made landfall as a tropical cyclone in the United States this year? my only chance. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to lose. I know there's Dorian. I know there's Barry. And um, Imelda. Yes! 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 All right, quickly. Cat six Are question. <laughs> Cat six question. This year's hurricane name list will next be used in what year? Oh, I can do math. <laughs> 2025? 2025, that's right. Wow. <laughs> I really just say I can do math. It was all about speed. <laughs> what? Together, we know more. And math. <laughs> and math. <laughs>